friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on November 1st, 2024. Welcome to another Survive Day on the Planet. Welcome to a quick video update here for you, sharing some imagery of the most recent X-Class solar flare, as it did produce a coronal mass ejection. So that means a solar storm is on its way. Watch for the flashy region coming in, top left region of our sun, right there. We had multiple events over the past 24 hours. Strong M-Class yesterday. A couple plasma filaments we've seen taking off from the surface of the sun. And as well swirling around and creating solar tornadoes around the equatorial region. Been sharing a lot of imagery here with Daily Events Worldwide. If you enjoy these videos, please don't forget to thumbs it up. Get in the comment section and share with your friends. Slowing imagery down here. We did have a couple events there on the front. We have 11 sunspot regions right now. And there is our most recent X-class solar flare. Same region that produced an M-class solar flare. And as well, outgoing sunspot regions. I've also shared close-up imagery of the incoming sunspot. It is colossal. If you haven't seen it yet, please check it out. Amazing images here brought to you by Solar Dynamics Observatory. Sharing most recent X-Class solar flare. A little look here with different filters. And as well, 304 angstroms. Big plasma filament there in the bottom right-hand corner of our sun. And you can see the strip, the stripe of plasma that is still attached to the sun. Watch that take off next. Even in the southern hemisphere, right around the polar region of the south. Watch for plasma swirling around there as well. Prominence, there it's also called solar prominence. I call it plasma because plasma, it is plasma. Look at this, amazing images here. Our spooky sun, October 31st into November 1st, 2024. 11 Earth-facing sunspots, X-class solar flare, M-class M solar flare, both Earth-facing, we are under intense solar radiation and coronal mass ejections are on their way. I want you to tell me what you think of these filters that I've been using recently. A little softer on the eyes for everyone. Hope you enjoy them. If you do, give a thumbs up. Timestamp your favorite part of this video. Look at that. Left-hand side there, solar tornado whipping around. Probably stands about 10 Earths tall. Much love, everybody, and I thank you for being a part of this family. Part of this journey. I'm really grateful that we're able to share these, this data and as well these images. Thanks to Solar Dynamics Observatory. Researched here with daily events worldwide. We have Earth facing coronal holes as well. Lots going on. Solar cycle 25. It's a pretty good start. Current conditions still under strong R3 radio blackout impacts from this most recent X class solar flare, X Toy 2.0. Nothing. Well, actually, a minor M class solar flare was just reported. So, strong M-class yesterday, strong X-class today. And this is a look at the last 24 hours of cosmic energies leaving our sun. Coronal mass ejection taking off from the south. And as well, Earth facing coronal mass ejection. That it will be visible here with the ISWA space prediction spiral. Showing the depicted coronal mass ejection taking off from our sun. Little yellow circle on the right-hand side is Earth. 
expected arrival date, November 3rd into 4th. Have a look at our current aurora forecast for tonight and in tomorrow. Not too much more tonight than tomorrow. Have a look at our solar winds right now. Left hand side showing the speeds, right hand side showing the pressure that all of these solar winds are putting on our planet right now. Much love, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this little update. Please share the channel. We're getting close to a goal that I've been going for. Much love. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your daily do. We'll see you next video. Bye-bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button. Subscribe. Share with your friends and family from across the world.